My name is Ami Warsu. I'm a consultant in palliative medicine. I work at the Royal Liverpool University Hospital. I also am the research lead at Marie Curie Hospice and I'm an honorary senior clinical lecturer at the University of Liverpool. The type of research I'm involved with is research working with people with serious illness, aiming to improve their quality of life. The research question I'd like to answer is how we can use technology and design to improve living environments for patients living with serious illness in order to improve their quality of life. This is really important because over the next 20 years, the need for palliative care in the UK will increase by 42%. And equally, the most common place of death by 2040 will be care homes. Therefore, it's essential that we understand how we can use technological applications in order to provide better care for patients who have serious illness as they approach the end of their lives. I'd like the research that I'm involved with to change clinical practice for patients and their families in two ways. Firstly, I want health care professionals to be able to better use data and technology in order to work out what the most important ways that they can help patients and their families. And secondly, I like for patients and their families themselves to be empowered through use of technology and applications so that they can self-manage themselves in order to improve their quality of life. My experience with the NIHR Scholars Programme has been fantastic. It's been so good for me, personally, to have dedicated time for research. This has been in a supportive environment, working with other scholars that have led to a mutual understanding and collaboration, which will help me and the future career paths of all people involved in the programme. It's also been of benefit to the organisations that I work for, as it's raised the importance of palliative care research through our networks and it's also alerted the work that NIHR are involved with. On a, a third level, it's also improved the working relationship for some of our staff as NIHR have been able to provide support and funding to enable other people who I work with to take part in research. <laughs>